revive my Minecraft survival playthrough. So here I am in my little... Well, yeah, I don't even really know what it is. And as you can see, my home is missing. It stood right here. So, yeah. I removed it and I now take shelter here in the actual mountain. Just here. I didn't have the smooth stone to fill this up, so that's kind of a shame. But oh, and I just like cleaned out this place. Oh my god, it's becoming night. Nice. So I just kind of cleaned out this little space here. And yeah, I think it's looking pretty neat. Okay, let's quickly take a nap and put down my. Fairness. Okay, nap time. So, okay, so my farm's still growing up there, and what I was, like, I was thinking about what I should do next, and was like, okay, get a bit of a base going, and so, of course, as I told you the first episode, I will try and go for the medieval theme. So, I will figure it. I mean, it's not really medieval, but I will like make a underground base of operations, fully made out of cobblestone, still give you that kind of medieval feeling so a lot of the stuff that I would do is just me like okay I got some cut oh what did I just do okay I have no idea what I just did and then just like this putting it back it will be really boring but it will be really cool once I finished so yeah that's my chest here just put it down and yeah I'm liking it really badly Okay, so what I um what was I going to do? Oh yeah. So like eventually I will try and get this place entirely well yeah closed just using glass. I think that will be really cool if it works out as I think it will. Then you can just like walk in here without any danger of it's will actually be like a greenhouse. You will just like feel the light, the sunlight in, at your skin, just really warm and you wouldn't have to fear any monsters attacking you, which might be the best part about it. And I could just build like a cute little house here. And of course my tree farm. I've now got a tree farm here. I really like that. Because, well, of course, wood is one of the materials you'll need. Really much. And especially when you're, like, making a bit of a medieval map, you will use a lot of wood, because wood is one of the mainly used resources to like make houses and that sort of stuff in the middle ages the dark ages however you want to call it oh my god a lot of my wheat actually grow grew I'm sorry and oh my god it isn't yet grown well fuck <laughs> so yeah I haven't yet this texture pack so much I guess so I am not really sure about things like that I think I'm not going to have too much problems but well it could always happen you know that I like think oh yeah that's just some 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 I don't even know what and then it is not and I like used the wrong pickaxe and I just destroyed it that I think it's like let's say um, diamond and it is obsidian that's likely not going to happen but things like that and oh my god 
god, that looks terrible. Well, good job, Notch. Way to go. <laughs> I should just get like the base of the tree and then burn it down with my flint and steel. That would be cool. And then like what I can't um like what's not burnt and is wood of course I could always use and just still chop down okay I'm just going to craft a oh first let me get this one I'm just going to craft a little flint and steel okay here's the flint there's the steel oh I'm lagging not laying anymore uh, like this yeah like that just oh my god two more trees damn nice and let's set it on fire and let's hope that no other trees will sprout in that time because then I would actually lose a lot of wood and I would not want that to happen at all and oh damn I didn't mean to do that yeah it will burn down pretty quickly now <laughs> okay 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 enough fun with the flint and timber for now Wow, I already depleted a lot of it. Okay, okay, um, just please let me think. Okay, so eventually I will like, perhaps even before the next episode, I will just make a ladder going up towards my farm with like special cool walkway on top of this hill just not have to like first walk there then up here and then come to the farm I don't even actually know why I built it so far away well it seemed a good idea at the time so yeah that was um, is this fully ground? I think so Okay, I'll not try, you know. I'll just don't don't take the risk. Just, no. No, not going to work, so yeah, not going to do it as well. Okay, first I'm going to take out the floor. So once I get a big <clears throat> once I get a big like really big oh yeah I forgot about the cave system down here and um, once I get a big cave system <sighs> once I get a big uh, okay let me yeah base of operations that's what I was trying to say I will eventually clear this place out and just make it into a hallway I think not completely sure about it. Oh. Okay, I admit it, I suck cock at this game. I don't actually suck cock, but you know what I mean. Down you go. Ho, ho, ho. Down you go, bitch. Crap. Oh, I still got another wooden door in my inventory. So, this is Xenforp Corporated, I think it's called, or an um, ink. That was it. Incorporated. Oh no. Oh no. Just why? Hmm. <laughs> 
Mojang. Jesus Christ. To get this then will take like one full X probably. Oh. So I know I haven't really done anything this episode. And I apologize for it, but I just told you about what I was going to do and that is the most important. And I will just do some of it on re <coughs> sorry, on camera, some of it off camera. And I'll just see, so yeah, a lot of trees are grown again. Yeah, okay, good. So yeah, that was it for this small little episode and I will see you guys next time. Adios.